Hello! Thought I'd do a video real quick to optimize my time and yours. I'll try not to ramble. But I wanted to tell you if you see a listing for a wallet and it says peeling inside the bill slot, don't run. This is a simple, easy trick that anyone can do because the vintage wallets still look beautiful, but inside the bill slot, often the lining degrades. So imagine getting a box like this, opening it up and seeing a beautiful wallet that looks uh, perfect. And the only thing wrong with it, which I already fixed this one, but I, ha I haven't on this one yet. The only thing wrong with it is a little bit of peeling. And it's usually on this type of lining right here. This won't ever peel. This is like that, that Tyaga uh, leather. So the trick is, I have a little bit of rubbing alcohol and a Q-tip and that's it. And you just rub it on there and it dissolves it off. It doesn't take that long, but as it dissolves, it kind of wears off on that. And you can do it yourself. And you don't have to do the whole thing. You can just do little bits at a time. And it never, in my experience, has ruined any of this. If you look inside here, sometimes this will peel. You can see that there. And you just run it across there. And you keep going. And you'll see it'll start to dissolve. I don't know if you can see that. See where it's kind of brown there? It kind of dissolves it into itself. Swap out your Q-tips every once in a while. And if you um, are not happy with the, the fact that it looks a little uneven, even though, who's going to see that? You can always dye it like I have on this Elise. I dyed it. So, a lot of times I just want to get a wallet out there, and it's beautiful, but it has a little bit of peeling. I don't want you to ever be afraid of that because it's easy to fix, and you'll have a beautiful wallet. This is my agenda, and if you look inside, there's a little bit, they call it spots peeling. It's a little bit of peeling, and it's been like that forever. It hasn't gotten worse, it hasn't gotten better, and it really hasn't gotten all over my stuff. Um, sometimes it can, but um, it doesn't bother me at all, and I just haven't taken the time to do this. So, try it. Look at a wallet if it's a style you like, and it, of course if it looks great on the outside, which a lot of these vintage wallets do, you just get this and it just comes off. See, it's starting to come off. Don't get it too wet, but it's not that hard. So, there's your little trick. And there's this one dyed. I dyed that one. This wallet's beautiful. I don't even think it was ever used. So, there's your trick. Don't be afraid of any peeling wallets. Oh, and I also did the same thing to this, which I haven't painted yet. I think I've showed you in the past that you can paint this. Um, I'm, I have this for a friend that I'm going to paint pink. But this I just used rubbing alcohol and a toothbrush, and it came right out. So have questions, ask me. I'll help you through it. Bye.